All right, from 88 FPS to 102 FPS, that's a 14 FPS increase. Now that's insane, honestly, just with upgrading our GPU and our bio. So what is up YouTube, it's Jason right here. And today Lenovo has just released a new GPU driver plus a BIOS update for Lenovo Legion Go. So if you're interested in this video, let's get started and stay tuned. All right, so you wanna go to the description down below and it'll take you to a direct download to, to get both the AMD GPU driver and the Lenovo Legion Go uh, BIOS update. So Legion Go actually fixes issues both in compatibility with games, performance improvements, and much more. So if you went to my video, um, my past video of how to upgrade your BIOS to the beta BIOS for the Legion Go, this is the fully released version. So uh, ignore that video and now install this one right here. This is fully out to the public. It's not in beta anymore, so all the bugs have been ironed out. Now the GPU are the GPU drivers are actually um, in beta, but they seem to be working pretty well. They actually improve performance, give better compatibility in games. So before we upgrade our GPU, I just want to show you on the previous version of the GPU, which were the November five uh, drivers. When we click on play on FC, this is one of the errors that we get in one of the selected games that I have here on my system. So if we open up um, FC24, it's going to stay on at the splash screen. So as you can see, it's loading up right now. So with the, with the November 5 drivers, it will stay to the game at all. So it will just stay here and with the new uh, GPU drivers, the new beta ones that I do have uh, provided in the description below, will actually fix this. As you can see, it's going to stay here for as long as it wants, and it's not going to fix itself until we upgrade our drivers to the newest ones. So if you run Call of Duty, it will actually tell us that we have very outdated drivers, which they are, even though they're the supposed November 5th drivers, but they're actually based on September uh, drivers from what I've heard. So. If we open up Call of Duty, uh, you'll see it will give us a warning that our drivers are out of date. So I just want to uh, show you guys really quick um, how that looks and how it's going to fix right now that we update our drivers. Sorry guys, I ran out of battery, but as you can see here, I am on my Legion Go right here. The lights are kind of dimmed off, but as you can see, your GPU driver version uh, does not meet the uh, requirements. And that's all because we have old drivers that were not new when the Lenovo Legion Go just released. So right now I'm gonna teach you how to actually upgrade your GPU drivers and BIOS. So, all right, so we're back and we're gonna upgrade our GPU driver right now. So we click right here and you wanna hold right here, hold it. You wanna select then hold and run this as administrator. Click on yes and be patient. Uh, so don't be afraid if it stays stuck on driver package, adding driver package, that's perfectly fine. It let it do its thing and let it do its thing and it's go uh, flash your screen, it's go rotate it and whatnot. And once it's done, it's gonna ask you to restart your PC. So that's what we're gonna do. So we're gonna restart our PC to apply the changes. It's a super quick process. All right, so our Legion Go has just um, restarted itself. All right, so we're actually upgrading our BIOS right here. So you wanna click on the BIOS icon right there. You wanna click on yes. It's gonna extract the, um, the folder. Let's go load up. And I do recommend you, please, I recommend you uh, plugging in your uh, Lenovo Legion Go to the power and let it charge because make sure, we gotta make sure that the uh, our Legion Go does not run out of power because this can break your Legion Go if any power uh, is cut off from the system. So you want to click on next. As you can see, it's giving you the warning. Next. And we're going to let us do its thing. So this is a little lengthy process. It does take around 10 to 15 minutes. And during those 10 to 15 minutes, uh, it's going to have a black screen. The Legion Go logo will show up on and off, on and off. And that's perfectly okay. You might have a black screen for a little bit. That's fine. Just be patient. Please be patient. Do not 
uh, power off your system. Do not even click this button. Do, don't you even think about clicking the button and let us do its thing. Connect it to the power. Go get some popcorn. Watch a movie for a little bit. Watch a quick YouTube video. All right, video so we just updated I don't care. both but our don't GPU to, do and not, BIOS do not right touch now. the power. All right, so we're right? going to see if so the we're let G- do new thing. GPU drivers once actually finishes, and and I'll be both right back. FC24 and with uh, Call of Duty uh, MW2. All right, so the first game I'm going to load is FC24. Just so you can see that I actually fix the splash screen uh, issue that it had. So right now it's going to load up. All right, here's the splash screen. So let's see if it fixed it right now. This is my first time seeing um, the Legion Go run it. I haven't, I have not seen this off camera or anything like that. So this could be a genuine reaction. All right, so FC24 did got fixed. Uh, we never got to this screen right here. So if I click on any button, is actually go and load up the game. This is amazing because I did miss uh, playing FC24 with the guys so many times because I was off uh, with my parents' house, you know. I wasn't able to play FC because the drivers didn't work. So as you can see, FC is working with the new uh, driver. So now let's test out Call of Duty and do a benchmark. On All right, so I just loaded up Call of Duty and I want to see if it gives us the error that our GPU drivers are out of date. So... We'll click over here. So let's go close out of Call of Duty. Because we are going to do a benchmark right now. Um, last time I saw... Last time I did a benchmark on Call of Duty, we actually got 88 FPS. 85 or 88 FPS. I'm not sure. Uh, you can look at the previous video or I can just put it up on the screen for you guys right now. But as you can see, there was no error that our GPU drivers were out of date. So right now, we are going to do a benchmark and see if we got an FPS uh, improvement or not. All right, so we're back at Call of Duty and we're going to perform a benchmark with the same, same settings. So let's start the benchmark right now. Um, I will put on the screen what I got previously on my previous performance guide upgrade. And we're going to see if the new GPU drivers actually made a difference right here, right now. So let this benchmark load up. I'm gonna let it play and you guys can see if it did something or not. All right, from 88 FPS to 102 FPS, that's a 14 FPS increase. Now that's insane, honestly, just with upgrading our GPU and our bio. So I think that deserves a like and a subscribe, honestly. All right, so if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe. The AMD new GPU uh, drivers actually did help a lot. So I'll see you in the next one and peace.